talk about the bounty hunter system. All right, so players can acquire the bounty hunter title through a quest available to citizens of military stage four town nodes and potentially their vassals or affiliated nodes. Bounty hunters can activate their pathfinding ability, which we'll talk about soon, to reveal corrupted player locations on their map. Corrupted players may kill bounty hunters without acquiring additional corruption score. And corrupted players' combat penalties do not apply when battling bounty hunters. A chief bounty hunter is a node government title that grants special access to NPCs in a node. Now we've got the bounty hunter maps. Players with a high enough corruption score will be visible on the world and mini maps. These players will have markers posted on the map by an NPC from a military node of at least stage four and will only be granted to players who have the bounty hunter title. The accuracy of bounty hunter maps is determined by a player's progression in the bounty hunter system. Taverns are one of the locations that bounties will be posted. As players gain corruption, taverns may offer bounties to eliminate those players and have specific area cleared of problem players, thus giving a POI or point of interest on the map. Last but not least, we're gonna talk briefly about the bounty hunter pathfinding ability. This will, as we said, reveal corrupted player locations on the bounty hunter's map. Activating this ability will flag the bounty hunter for combat only to corrupted players for a period of one hour from the time of activation. The pathfinding ability can be toggled on and off. That outlines our bounty hunter discussion. It's pretty short. We don't have too much on it yet. It's gonna be interesting to see what people come up with on this one because we've we've briefly touched on this one a little bit. Uh, however, there have been a lot of people that have been bringing this one up uh, in the past like month or so at the time of this video, especially since around the time the Ashes went viral. You can check out that uh, Ashes Pathfinders podcast episode where we kind of talked about that. Actually, Steven came on for that one. But my point is, is uh, there was there's been a lot of discussion around the bounty hunter system, things like the family summons. These are elements that have been uh, talked about both in the Ashes of Creation community, here in this community, and we have been outlining some of that on the HQ, Ashes HQ, so definitely check it out. Now, if if you all have enjoyed this video, definitely come check out asheshq.com. Come catch up uh, with us here on Twitch. You can also catch us every Sunday for the Ashes Pathfinder show, friends. It's been a pleasure as always. All right, bye. Bye. Bye.